Kimberly with Overland Objective. Um, today, this afternoon, we are putting in some Molly panels. Um, Ethan put these in that we got a, about a week or two ago. These are rear window Molly panels that he got from Cali Raised. Uh, he picked this particular brand and this style because it goes all the way down to the wheelbase to provide for extra storage room. We have one for each side. Um, he, re he researched these for a little while to see what he felt would work best, what would work best for our lifestyle, um, and how much we travel and all of that stuff. Um, as you can see here, he has already hung up some stuff. Right here we have the first aid kit that Daniel, our Overland Objective um, team paramedic, gave us for our um, first Christmas after we got married. It's very, it's a very extensive um, first aid kit. Whenever it's done by a paramedic, then you know that it's going to be good. But um, yeah, everything's in there and there's still plenty of room whenever this is folded up which is really hard to do one-handed. But when this is folded up, there's still lots of room for where it can, um, what all can hang on there. We've got our fire extinguisher there, which is always a good idea to have. And then over here we have a bag. This actually came out of my black Jeep that has um, a tailgate Molly panel holder, or Molly holder. And in here I have my Go Girl, um, which I discovered a couple of months ago has really helped with um, using the restroom on the trail while you're pregnant. So highly recommend. There's also some ponchos in here. And um, of course, Ethan has his zip ties because he loves zip ties. Um, and as mentioned before, there's lots of room for extra accessories in the bottom and the top. And um, you know, once we start having, you know, kiddos outside of the womb, we will, um, it, it will free up a lot more space for, hi honey, hi. you're in the, <laughs> you're in the video. Um, it's warm today. <laughs> it is. Um, it'll free up a lot more room to have stuff off of the floor and, you know, the stuff that we um, we'll be keeping in the vehicle all the time that we don't need to take out whether, um, I mean, there's just so many things that you can just carry with you all the time anyways. Uh, Ethan is putting in these, um, console panels. They're kind of hard to see in this light. You can kind of see them a little bit better right there. Um, on both sides, um, this will help keep some stuff, um, more accessible whenever we're driving. And um, he's also wanting to put his radio on that side to keep everything cleared off of the dash and make it a little bit more accessible as well. And he got these. Where'd you get these from? Rango Manufacturing. Or I, Rago? Rago. I know there's not an N in there. Rago Manufacturing. You're the one that ordered it. <laughs> I know, but I thought it was Ragu. <laughs> but I know that's spaghetti sauce. Um, but the, um, actually both sets of the panels came in a very timely manner. Um, we had both sets within two weeks. The first one we had within a few days, didn't we? Mm -hmm. um, so here he is putting the other side on. Do what? So now I guess I'll just record you doing some stuff. How's it going? Oh, it's going pretty good. Seems like it's going pretty quickly for the most part. Yeah, for the most part. Yeah, you know that ratchet. Mm -hmm. The big one or the little? The big one. It's so neat. Oh, you're welcome. So why did you pick this particular one? Were you able to find any other ones or did you like this one for a specific reason? It's 
the one you found? It seemed like it had the most real estate. Yeah. Uh, it does go pretty far up. Uh, yeah. That goes to right under the um, glove department. I like that in the future we can put a, a cover that goes over the over the front cup holder and shifter to mount an iPad or oh yeah something along those lines if we if we get that far into it who knows we might find that you can just hold an iPad <laughs> yeah cheaper than that that's also true <laughs> we'll see Buttoning everything up now. Clipping everything. Clipping everything in. Sure we get this harness plugged in here underneath screw the shifters back on and we're in business that didn't really seem to take you too awful long no nah, it may it took um, like an hour maybe. Yeah. It's not too so, bad. Between that and helping dad get the tractor going to put a culvert in. and Not too shabby. Looks good. Very nice. Just needs swept out now. Yep. Um, what are your closing thoughts? Uh, that was a pretty easy install. The worst part is taking all the dash apart, and that's really not even that hard either. It yeah. all clips in. Yeah. So it's not. It's not too bad. And it'll increase our storage options, so that's nice. Yep. Help get some things off the floor. Yep, I think I put this first aid kit in a bad place. But... We'll see later on. Everything rides. So... Yep. Thanks for watching, guys. Keep on adventuring.